So let's have a look at waterfalls today. Waterfalls um, are part of the upper course of a river. So a river having three courses, upper, middle and lower course. Um, and waterfalls and gorges generally form part of that upper course. So it's quite steep, um, narrow rivers rather than those big wide ones you see by the coastline. So let's have a look at how they formed. So first I'm going to draw the surface of the earth and what's important here is that inside um, we're going to see different layers of sedimentary rock. Um, it could be metamorphic or igneous as well but in this instance we're just going to talk about two different types of sedimentary. Um, and what we've got are layers, so you've got more resistant, less resistant, and you'll probably find a couple of bands of um, less and more resistant rock um, throughout the landscape, so you'll end up getting a tiered, you know, several waterfalls in a row, because you're going to have a bunch of waterfalls forming this way. And I'm only going to show you one waterfall in this video. So we've got the river running along the surface, and it's going to start eroding that less resistant rock. So as that happens, you can see it's eroding the less resistant rock that's in front of the more resistant rock, but obviously it's leaving that, that more resistant rock alone. Um, and then we're, what we're going to start seeing forming here is a bit of a cliff. So that is our, the back of our waterfall. Um, and the beginnings of a plunge pool are going to start forming. So what happens in this gap um, beneath the, the waterfall is little bits of rock and debris land up in that um, plunge pool below and the water is going to move them around and it's going to create a bit of a, a deeper pool um, and this is where you know when you see people jumping off waterfalls into um, you know, kind of deep plunge pools. This is kind of what you're looking at. Obviously, you need to find out if the bottom of the pool has lots of rocks in it because we know that those fall off the top of that waterfall. So please don't just go jump off cliffs randomly now. Um, so uh, what will carry on happening now is that those rocks at the bottom of the plunge pool are going to keep eroding and you'll find that we get like a cave almost forming behind um, the waterfall. Very like... Pocahontas, um, John Smith behind a waterfall moment. Um, I love Disney. Okay, so what's going to happen is because of that um, cave forming behind the waterfall, the, the area above it isn't going to be supported anymore. So we're going to find that that bunch of rock is going to fall down and create part of that plunge pool. It's going to form those rocks at the bottom of the plunge pool. Um, and that image there shows you what what it could end up looking like or rather how a plunge pool would look on the inside where there's pebbles and rocks scrape around the outside and they kind of create a round shape. So that was a small scale. This is happening on a much bigger scale. Um, and those are going to continue. Those rocks are going to continue moving around inside that plunge pool, eroding away the back of the waterfall there. Um, creating that little cave or notch and that is not going to support the rock above it and that rock is going to fall into the plunge pool and carry on creating the cycle. I'm just going to um, do it one more time here uh, where we're going to erode back, um, have that cave forming, more rocks are going to get involved, we've got more erosion happening, that plunge pool gets deeper and that top falls off again and forms part of that plunge pool. So what we got here, you can see where the original um, cliff face was, right? And I'm going to draw it in here. Um, so the original cliff was about there. Um, and as the waterfall Kind of continued on its normal course what we end up with is waterfall retreat now the waterfall didn't take a step backwards and say i retreat i'm going back no what happened is it appeared to retreat and all that happened was it eroded back um, so it looks like it's retreating but it's just being eroded so that is how waterfall forms if you have any questions write a comment below um, like share subscribe and tune in for the next one.